shotgun. My friend sitting next to me turned towards me and she um she got um part of a bullet hit her in the mouth. Witnesses say the suspect may have used tear gas at a moment in the movie when the same thing was happening on screen. Rounds penetrated into theater eight next door. More than 250 police have responded to the scene, along with 100 FBI agents. Back is full of blood. I don't know if that matters or not. Full of what? Blood. Excessively. Back seats are full of biohazard material. Police say they've arrested the suspect described as an adult male, 24 years old, heavily armed and heavily armored. But police believe at this point that he was acting alone. The suspect was found with three weapons, including a possible assault rifle. The suspect, who is in custody, made statements about possible explosives uh, in possession of his residence. And we are dealing with the potential that there are explosives inside there. We're also concerned about explosives in the parking lot, hence the parking lot is completely sealed off. Survivors and witnesses have been taken to a triage area at a local high school. Now at that local high school where witnesses and victims have been taken, there were four busloads, we understand, of people who were taken there to be interviewed by authorities. We know that FBI victim advocates are also on the scene helping out. And one of the victims we have learned, uh, George and Amy, is a three-month-old baby. Mm. Disturbing indeed. Clayton, thank you very much. Let's bring in eyewitness Erin Post now. She is 15 years old. She saw the shooter. She was in the theater at the time, and she joins us now. Erin, good morning. And I, I understand uh, you, when you first heard the shots, what happened in that theater? You were sitting there with your friends. Um, the first thing you actually heard was something fly across the movie theater and and soon after that, you hear it kind of smell the tear gas or whatever you use. And then soon after that, you just know, like, gunshots coming from the corner of the movie theater. And it's just like, you hear bang, 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 just like really, really loud. And everybody just like screaming and just turns into chaos. And everybody's just trying to get down and get out and just do the gunshots. <laughs> and Aaron, I understand that the timing of the shooting coincided with a moment on screen in the movie that it seemed like maybe this was all a part of the movie, correct? Was it surreal, confusing? Well, this was, um, everybody, at first, you know, when the thing exploded, everybody just thought it was, um, special, not, not necessarily special effects, but things that had already put together, like the movie theater, to, you know, go along with the movie, but then shortly... America, this is so done, crazy. Has, done, has it come to know, us having to be... Uh, search before we can go into the movie theater. Aaron, Let's say a prayer for all these families and everyone that was at this movie theater on last night or earlier this morning. Thanks for stopping by and have a blessed morning. Bye.